Hey y'all, it's Dan. Name of my channel is Numerical Lion. As you may know, I was on the Facebook and somebody had posted this about Nicholas Sand, creator of the famous Orange Sunshine LSD, died at 75. I thought this was a recent death, but he died in 2017. The story is from May 16th. 2017. It's interesting too because this story is posted a ways after his death. Makes me wonder. So Swiss scientist Albert Hoffman may have invented LSD and Timothy Leary was clearly its most prominent frontman, but it was a self-taught chemist and obscure by choice figure named Nicholas Sand who was the true wizard behind the curtain. The man who launched tens of millions of acid trips Cross generations by producing the best, most pure, highest quality acid ever consumed across generations. So he and Tim Scully created the legendary version of LSD known as Orange Sunshine, which hit the streets of San Francisco in 1967. He died April 24th at his home in Northern California, community of La Guanitas. He was 75 and had spoken the day before at a psychedelic science conference in Oakland where the film The Sunshine Makers was screened. So let's go to the decode here. Nicholas Sand, here he is, born May 10th, 1941 in New York. His parents, his dad is Clarence Hiskey, and Clarence Hiskey developed, he was a chemist who worked on the top secret Manhattan Project to develop the atomic bomb until authorities caught him spying for the Soviet Union. So with Hiskey's wife divorced him and she restored her maiden name and gave it to her son. So he comes from a famous line of chemists. Very interesting how a lot of these people who you think are counterculture, you know, people have a military, scientific, military intelligence background. Thinking of, uh, there's a story, a documentary about Laurel Canyon and about the artist there that had military backgrounds their families had military intelligence backgrounds and became you know big stars like Jim Morrison of the Doors his father was an admirable an admiral almost an admirable in the Navy during the Vietnam War was involved in the Gulf the infamous Gulf of Tonkin incident that was his father Admiral Morrison so for those that don't know, you should check out um, the whole Laurel Canyon piece about the different rock stars and their connections to military intelligence. It's pretty eye-opening. So he was a chemist. Let's look at, he's from Brooklyn, New York, home of the 74. Chemist. So his father's name was Hiskey. And that was his, that's his real last name. Look at Hiskey and Chemist. Basically a perfect match in three out of the five ciphers if you include the S exception, 77, 32, and 41. He was born in 41. So from his last birthday to his death was 349 days. If you count the day, it was 350. And LSD 
equals 35, kind of like 350. Three forty nine, a special number. It's a prime number, the seventieth prime number, and that is interesting because Nicholas Sand equals seventy. Notice that all Sand equals twenty five. That story about him was updated. What was that story updated? Eight twenty five. Like death is twenty five. May sixteenth. So he died on the twenty fourth. And they didn't get the story out until the 16th. Let's see if we can figure out why. The 24th of 2017 to May 16th, 22 days. It took them 22 days to get out the story. David 58 numerology, Freemasonry 58, also 31 like chemist, right? So, so Nicholas Sand 70, Orange Sunshine 70, what a coincidence. Sand itself, 70. Nicholas Sand also equals 65. It's funny that I should be, somebody should mention his death, you know, in the time of coronavirus. These are coronavirus numbers, even though he died well before the coronavirus. He died on a day with 65 numerology. His name equals 65. Also, sand equals 38, like murder, death, killing. And he died on a day with 38 numerology. How appropriate. Look at the Sunshine Makers. That's the name of the film. 209 and 74. From Brooklyn, New York equals 74. And Orange Sunshine, 209 and 74. These same numbers. He died with 251 days left in the year. Obviously a ritual sacrifice. Ritual sacrifice 251. So rest in peace to this man, Nicholas Sand. From New York. Born in 41 like a chemist. San Francisco. Let's check out San Francisco before we go. Equals 50. Full name Nicholas Francis Sand. 81 like ritual. This guy Hiskey. Clarence F. Hiskey. Clar he took his middle name from his father, Clarence Francis Hiskey. Born on July 5th. San Francisco 76, the reflection of 67. Eighteen, that death number. So sixty-six, eighty-one ritual number, just like his son. He's famous for the atomic. You know, working on the Manhattan Project, the atomic bomb. Ninety-three. Interesting. So that'll do it. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day or evening. 
the murder by numbers story. Have a good one, everybody. Stay safe. Love one another.